Well, it is about 5.30. The sun is now coming up and we are on our way. I don't even really know what to expect, but I'm excited. Nervous, but excited. And we have a very pretty sunrise if that actually shows up. Uh, one of the best parts about Colorado is the beautiful scenery that we have out here. There's a really cool mountain range over here. You can see the mountains. And uh, it's always very, very beautiful in the mornings. <laughs> uh, the one downside is the mosquitoes, but uh, we're in a car for now, so haven't had too many problems with them. Well, we are here. We are out in the field. They are gonna get the balloon set up over there, it looks like, and we have we are with a adventure balloon. So um, hopefully this will be pretty cool. It's a nice area. We're in this kind of field-ish place, and uh, I'm pretty excited. I I think they'll probably be starting this, starting to fill it up pretty soon. <laughs> They're getting the balloon set up. <laughs> it's pretty big. I didn't, I knew they were big. I didn't know they were this big. <laughs> so the basket's on its side and then the whole balloon is laid out here on this tarpy thing. It's pretty big and I think they're going to start inflating it. There are a couple of other companies over here and they are actually starting to inflate the balloons. You can see some going up over there. So pretty, pretty cool. I must confess I'm a little nervous. I don't really know what to think about what's going to happen. Uh, but yeah, we will see. <laughs> we'll see how this goes. So we have these balloons are going up. These are not ours. Ours is still not inflated, but holy cow, they're huge. I knew they were big, but I didn't know they were going to be this big. That is a huge balloon. Oh man, <laughs> wow. And our balloon is now going up. Or starting to, oh, I like the color scheme. <laughs> it's kind of my colors. <laughs> uh, we just got briefed on safety and stuff. I do apologize, it's kind of loud. There's a lot of fans running behind me. Uh, but we do have, yeah, our balloon is gonna go up now. So, oh man, you guys, <laughs> this is happening. Um, I'm not entirely sure what to think. I, I hope it's gonna be pretty pretty fun. I'm a little worried because, okay, I should clarify, I'm not exactly scared of heights, I'm scared of falling. <laughs> but uh, I don't necessarily do super well with being up in the air. So, uh, yeah, we'll see how this goes. <laughs> uh, they say it takes about 10 minutes to inflate fully, but man, you can have an idea of just the scale of this. You can see there are some people helping hold open the flap. You can see that is the scale of this balloon. It is absolutely massive. Uh, if you guys have ever seen these things flying around, they don't look that big, but they are. They really are. They are absolutely humongous. Uh, this is what's gonna be carrying us for about an hour. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I just hope all goes well. like a huge giant cave almost of fabric. It's absolutely huge. Absolutely huge in there. So yeah, very, very cool. The balloons behind us are going up. You can see the one, especially in the back, is actually going upright. They're tipping, I think, the basket up. Again, you can see just absolutely huge, how huge these things are. Those are trucks by them. Uh, that this over here, the white thing, is a truck. A huge truck. And that's the balloon. These things are gigantic. They just started putting the burners on on this one, I think, to get it upright. So I don't know if it's gonna shoot off fire again like it did before, but it, it just shot off some fire. Um, I think they have to get it tipped up right. Oh yeah, here it goes. It's starting to lift, I think. They heat up the air inside and that's what makes it rise. Because warm air rises and cold air sinks. If the air in the balloon is hotter than the air around it, then it's going to go up. It's not like how they have to have helium. Oh, you can see the burner on this one is starting to go. They're getting ready to lift off probably. So yeah, pretty, pretty cool. Fire going, you can see. Look at that. That is a lot of fire. What that's gonna do is heat up the air inside the balloon. 
alone. Like I said before, it makes it warmer than the air outside. And so it's gonna start to rise. You'll see this balloon is gonna start picking up off the ground like the other one did. I'll see if I can get that on camera. You can see how it's starting to lift. It's slowly coming upright. That's because the air inside is heating up. It's completely off the ground now, at least the balloon part. And they're gonna right the basket now and get it ready to take off. Look at the fire. <laughs> That's what we stand underneath. I was told I had to bring a hat because it can get really hot on your head if you don't have a hat. Because you stand underneath that fire and you can see just how much flame is actually coming out of there. Uh, it is quite a substantial amount and so I'd imagine it would be quite warm. So yeah, that's a lot of fire. Here we go. They're gonna, it looks like they're gonna get, they're getting that upright. And probably are gonna lift off pretty soon. They just started the fire in our balloon over there. It looks like they're getting it upright. Here's a bit of a different perspective. You can see the three balloons that are already up. And then ours is the blue one in the back. <laughs> So look at the fire, I hope you can see that okay. Sorry if it's a little bouncy, I'm walking right now. <laughs> I think it's going up. They've started lighting the fires inside and it looks like it's lifting off the ground. So we're all gonna get in once the balloon's upright and then it takes a little bit for it to actually get off the ground. So a lot of the other ones are, I think, preparing to leave as well. So we're probably gonna be the last ones up. But man, it's pretty stinking cool. Look at the fire. Here's an up close and personal look with some of the fire. Even from back here, I can feel the heat of the flames. It's really hot. Oh, and here we go. We're lifting off the ground. Look at that go. Wow, this is cool. There goes the basket. Yeah, there it goes. There it goes! <laughs> oh, here we are, we're upright, just about. There they go. The fire up here, up here goes off every so often and it still makes me really, really jumpy. <laughs> so I, if, I, if I start suddenly, it's probably just the flames coming on suddenly. A few, a few, of, the, um, a few of the balloons have already taken off, it looks like. Are flying away. Oh boy, you guys. What have I gotten myself into? <laughs> oh, what have I gotten myself into? Oh, we're up. Oh, we're up. Here we go. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> oh my goodness. Here we go. Oh man, we're actually rising really quickly. I did not expect this. It's a little bumpy, but not that bad so far. There's another balloon off there up ahead, the one next to us. Um, wow, okay. We're all flying this way. Wow, this is actually, wow, there's our shadow way down there. <laughs> that is cool. Wow, we are rising really fast. Super exciting. Wow. This is very cool. Very, very cool. Oh, there, yeah, there's horses down there. Um, we are getting really high up. I'm just trying not to look straight down because we are getting pretty high up. So, I think we're going to get a lot higher up too. Um, yeah, we're gonna get a lot higher. Uh, this is gonna be interesting, you guys. This is gonna be interesting. When, when the burners aren't on, it's actually pretty quiet. 
It's a little a little rocky. It's, it's rocking slightly. Oh, there go the birds. There's our shadow way down there. And yeah, it's very, very scenic view out here. It's uh, pretty cool, yeah. We still go. I'm a little nervous. Oh my goodness, yeah. Uh, don't look at this if you're if you get sick from heights. <laughs> but this is how high we are, and we're still rising. Uh, this is a little bit scary. I'm just gonna hang on tightly. <laughs> There's a bunny running down there. I don't know if you guys can see him. I can't see him. But he's bunny. oh yeah, he's he's moving right. He's moving right down there. He's moving down there by that uh, fenced off area. He's just teeny. Wow. There are other balloons that were down there, <laughs> so they're all going on ahead of us. Some of them over the some of them are over the lakes there. Ooh. Startled me a bit, I must confess. Anyway. Well, I know you guys have all been waiting for this moment. So, while well, I am up here, I don't know exactly how far off the ground in a hot air balloon, this is me, Jay. I'm way higher up in the air than I've ever been outside an airplane, and it's actually not too bad. <laughs> I'm rather enjoying myself, to be honest. Yeah, it's less scary than I thought it was going to be, and I'm not dead of a heart attack, so that's something. <laughs> oh. <laughs> We're flying out over this lake now. Uh, kind of pond. A pond sort of thing. I don't know exactly what it is. It's very it's square. Reservoir. Maybe a reservoir, probably. Do you see the oh yeah, you can see the reflection of the balloon. That's cool. Wow. That's pretty neat. Way back there is where we started out. We've actually come quite a ways now. Uh, you can see we, we've flown all this distance already and we haven't been up here all that long. And uh, wow, we are really, really close to this pond actually. Uh, very close to the pond. It's kind of a murky pond. But yeah, <laughs> we're very close to this pond. But we do have an absolutely beautiful view of the scenery out back this way. We have the mountains in the background. It is pretty amazing. Uh, very, very cool. The re reflections back there on the lake are absolutely gorgeous. Yeah. Um, uh, honestly, it's it's not the cleanest lake, but it's 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 very pretty. <laughs> yeah. There is a duck way back out here flying across the lake. Trying to get a closer look at that. Oh, it's landing. Cool. Actually, that's a goose. That's a Canada goose. And we are rapidly ascending again, uh, going up pretty, pretty quickly. <laughs> uh, we really do rise quite fast once we get up. the flames going off without jumping. <laughs> it doesn't start to be quite so bad anymore. <laughs> We've got an absolutely gorgeous view of the mountains from up here. Um, it's, it's quite picturesque, really. Um, it's honestly a very, very beautiful scene. I, I didn't know what to expect from this, but it's very, very pretty up here. Uh, definitely, uh, definitely <laughs> already enjoying this. It's not as scary as I thought it would be. There is a uh, very, very another uh, another reservoir or lake area down here that we're flying over now, uh, shining in the sunlight down there. Um, I was, honestly, this whole place is really a. Uh, it's. There's something about this area of Colorado that's just absolutely beautiful, and seeing it from the air is uh, honestly amazing. <laughs> uh, I wasn't sure what to expect. I wasn't sure if this would be like a plane ride or what, but no, definitely not. It's completely and totally different than the feeling you get flying in an airplane. Here's the view the other direction, less mountains. Uh, the sun is coming up over here. out across the landscape here it's much more of a 
um, a rural area than where I live. Um, I live in more of a suburb, but uh, yeah, it's definitely, there are, there are some more populated areas, but uh, there's a lot of more rural areas as well too, so it's really uh, almost kind of, I don't quite know the word for it, it's, it's a very nice place. <laughs> We're coming back around where we can see the mountains again over here. And uh, it, honestly, the view is absolutely incredible. It, it's very, very beautiful. <laughs> it's a pretty place even from the ground, but from the air, it's absolutely amazing. <laughs> you can see a bunch more reservoir areas just kind of sprawled out across. There's a, a lot of water area over there. And um, it's kind of almost a little misty up here. And it's actually, it is quite cool. Despite all the, the heat of the plane, the actual air temperature up here is uh, pretty cool because we're getting to be kind of high up. If we look down, that's about how far off the ground we are. Um, I feel a lot more secure up here than I expected. Uh, I thought it would be more feeling like you could tip over the edge, but um, it's actually, the walls are very high and I feel pretty secure up here. There's little places you can grab on inside this basket, so I can hang on here if I need to. <laughs> Again, the, the landscape is just absolutely beautiful. You can see the mountains behind me. Um, such a beautiful view. It really is. Way back there. All those buildings, that's Denver. And, uh, we are very high up, so you can actually see the wide ways. Way back there is Denver. <laughs> way back there is Denver. <laughs> we, can, we can still see the cars from here, but they look pretty tiny down there. <laughs> and, uh, you can see there's fields, you can see the circles from the irrigation. Uh, it's pretty cool to see. This is the point when it's settling in how high up I really am, and I kind of can't believe I'm here right now. Um, it's very, very uh, It's something, that's for sure, something else. <laughs> Not what I expected. It's actually quite peaceful and it's like almost completely silent when the flames aren't going. Um, it's quite an unbelievable experience really. It's very smooth. I did not expect it to be this smooth. You can feel it a little bit rocking sometimes, but for the most part it's really, really smooth. Okay, yeah, this is really high up. <laughs> um, it's, it is pretty high up. This is when uh, it does sink in a little bit that you're flying in a balloon, a basket suspended from a balloon, quite some distance above the ground. <laughs> it's a little nerve-wracking sometimes, but uh, it's, it's a great view. <laughs> it really is a great view. We're getting even higher. We are still going up. Believe it or not, we are still going up. Uh, yeah, we are really high <laughs> right now. We are really high up in the air and still rising. It's honestly incredible. It's incredible that technology has come this far too. And balloons aren't even that recent a technology. Not, or maybe not recent, but it's honestly amazing that we can do this. <laughs> We're actually coming back towards the field we took off from down there. Just very distantly see. That's where we took off from. And we're kind of floating back towards it because the wind moves differently at different points in the air. So we're higher up now. So. We're about a mile up right now. Um, yeah, it's that. It's pretty far. It's pretty far. That's houses down there. <laughs> um, yeah, I didn't know how far up we would actually go, but it is a. It is pretty far up. It gives you a beautiful, great view, though. 
It's actually really, uh, really still up here. You don't feel a lot of the wind, even though it is moving us. And it's not like super gusty or anything. In fact, if it does get super gusty, they probably can't fly because it could be uh, dangerous. So that's a lot of the time why the uh, balloons go up in the morning is because the wind hasn't really picked up as much yet. This is a lot further off the ground than I ever thought I would be. <laughs> uh, outside of an airplane, that is. It's very far. It's less scary, but far. <laughs> Two of the other um, balloons are off this way, going more in that direction, and then the third is out there. So they're still flying as well. We've been up here for around an hour now, and uh, that's the area over here is where we came from. So we've uh, gone quite a ways, actually. Um, we're still pretty high up. And, uh, yeah. It's a uh, pretty cool experience, really. Uh, something I'll probably never get to again, so I'm really thankful to be up here. We're gonna start coming down here, so this is one last view way up in the air. You can see the mountains in the background. The beautiful, beautiful scenery. It's a lot greener than where I come from. <laughs> the other balloons are all landing, and I think we're gonna be starting to descend soon as well. So, yeah, we've been up here for around an hour. It's been a pretty cool ride. <laughs> Here we go, we are descending. <laughs> oh, and the blue one is just touched down down there, it looks like, or just about. The white one is a little bit further up the ground, and then the red one's coming down. The white one's shadow is across the road. We're looking at the position of the shadows to judge how far the off the ground the balloons are. There's our shadow way out there, that little black dot. That's getting closer, so that means we're going down. We are landing near a small airport. Planes over there. We're landing near this little airport area. We're actually coming down fairly quickly. It's not super fast. Like, I can't perceive that we're going down. I can't feel it like you can, like, you know, if you go over a hill really fast or you go on a roller coaster. It's not that sort of a drop feeling, but uh, you can tell we're getting closer to the ground because everything's slowly getting closer. It looks like we may come down in this field here, possibly. It's kind of hard to judge still. There's this kind of open area with an access road. <laughs> So uh, they have to have access areas that are pretty close because if they don't, the truck that carts them around can't come pick them up. So they got to be close to some sort of road so they can get the balloon to the, the trailer. There is the airport we're nearby. It's got a lot of small planes uh, down, sitting down there. Our shadow is a lot bigger and closer as we are descending. So it's uh, closer than it was when it was just that teeny little dot out there. We're kind of going a little bit up and down as we try to figure out a good spot with the winds to land. That is getting even closer. And we're near, it looks like a drainage ditch place down there where it's all vegetation. There's vegetation. It looks like there's some, uh, some water down there, but we're going to go past that. Hopefully not. Hopefully not. You can see our shadow is coming towards us, which means we're getting lower. We kind of moved away from that first field, but it looks like we might be heading towards over here. Another balloon drop that way, but I don't think we're going to get as far as that. Probably going to land somewhere in this area here. Seems to be where the wind is taking us. And there's some bunnies down here running. The bunnies as we are are flying by. 
And then there, once more up here, is our shadow as we are flying over here and uh, getting ready to land. <laughs> There's the truck that is coming to pick us up. We're probably going to land. Our shadow is quite close now, uh, just a little ways off. So we are getting pretty low on the ground. Our uh, truck came and then is going to turn around, it looks like, to get ready to pick us up. We're coming in for a landing. We are coming in for a landing. I think we might... Oh man, we're down like right, right on top of this, uh, the trailer practically. Oh, we're gonna land right here. We're gonna land right here. <laughs> Oh wow, yeah, I'm gonna hold on just just to make sure. We're not quite gonna hit the trailer, but it looks like we're kinda come down. Oh, let's not hit the people on the ground. <laughs> They're here ready to catch us. Oh. Oh, here we go. I think we're gonna try and land in this paved area. Ooh. Ooh. Wow. Oh, a little bit squishy landing. Yeah, a little squishy. Wow, oh, not quite. Woo! Woo! So that is the hot air balloon ride, you guys. That is a hot air balloon ride. We're actually, they're actually balancing us right over to this trailer here. Uh, we've got some people out there pushing. Oop! And we're bouncing. Woo! Woo! They are bringing down the, the top of the balloon now. Uh, Alright, do that initial one. Go ahead. They're bringing it down. They've got a cord. And... Whoa. Whoa. All There's right, the inside of the balloon. Woo! Man. Guys. Woo! Wow. Oh, they're actually pulling the top Yeah, look at it. It's in. opening. You see yeah, it? they're opening the top up there. So that'll help collapse the balloon. Yeah, you can see it's closing up. Oh, that's neat. They're uh, they are pulling down the the balloon here. They're getting all wrapped up and bundled. Wow. <laughs> They're kind of just wrestling it to the ground like this. I'm squeezing the air out of it slowly. Pretty stinking cool. <laughs> yeah, so this has been the big balloon ride. Um, it was fun. I honestly expected to be a lot more scared, but I really wasn't. It was, it felt a lot safer than I thought it was going to. Um, I had some concerns about it, but, uh, yeah, it was really, really fun. Um, definitely, I, if I got the chance, I probably would do it again. <laughs> uh, so very, very cool experience. I uh, got a lot of cool footage of the mountains from up there. Absolutely gorgeous view. And uh, pretty cool to see them tearing this balloon down, too, or trying, getting it all wrapped up like this. They just get it back into this long noodle thing that they had it in to start out with and then they pack it in the truck that's back there <laughs> and uh, then they bring us back to where we launched from too so we can get back to our cars. Uh, the whole thing took about an hour with a little bit more to get the balloon up and down and such not. Uh, but yeah, it was very, very cool. <laughs> I, I definitely enjoyed it. So thank you guys so much for watching and a huge thank you to our balloon crew. Uh, you can, uh, you. you guys are uh, Adventure Balloon Sports, right? Yes. Yeah. So if you guys are by Boulder, Colorado and you're looking to do a balloon ride, definitely check these guys out. They did a great job. Uh, so anyway, huge thank you to them and thank you to you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you guys on our next adventure. But until then, this is Jay, over and out.